Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Bowser N64, and uh, just a second, guys. So basically, we are going to be here, and uh, I'm going to be showing you guys something kind of interesting. You know, there's a lot of things on forums and stuff about how to... <coughs> okay, I'm sorry about that, guys. But there's a lot of things on forums about trying to run Assassin's Creed Liberation HD, right? It's a great game. It's got some great gameplay in it and stuff like that but it's really hard to run and that's one thing that we're trying to figure out for you guys basically is uh we're going to kind of walk you through how to get this thing to run and to work all right so basically what i want to tell you guys is the steps that are required to get assassin's creed liberation to work so basically the first thing that you're going to want to do is uh go down to your steam here you're also going to want to go right click on your library, go to properties, and as you go to properties, you go to local files. You're going to want to go hit browse to local files. And this is also very important, guys. You want to make sure that the game is installed on the C drive. I'm not sure if the game will work otherwise, but all the resources I've looked at on the forums and stuff say that it's good to have this game installed on the C drive instead of like a D or an E drive, additional hard drive in addition to your main operating system loading drive because the game, um, I guess, is not optimized for other different drive setups. So that's basically one thing I wanted to put in there real quick. But you want to hit browse to local files right there. And as you can see, I have it on the C drive right here. It's in this location right here. And uh, there you go. C program files, times 86, Steam, Steam apps, common Assassin's Creed liberation. Um, and it's also important to, to uh, I guess that this will also work with the original liberation. This is liberation HD, which I grabbed on the Steam store not too long ago. And it was only like four, four ninety nine. It was like five bucks. It's like an incredible deal. So yeah, guys. Basically, what you're going to want to do is you want to highlight AC three LHD thirty two EXE. You're going to want to right click there, hit properties. You want to go to compatibility mode, and this is very, very important, guys. You want to change this compatibility mode. It's going to be off like this. But what you want to do is you want to go ahead and change this compatibility option to Windows 7. Now, there, the forums and stuff that I've looked at say you can run this on Windows 8 compatibility mode. And you may be able to do that, but your mileage will vary. But if you run this on Windows 7, you're good to go. And uh, that's how I got it working anyway. So I hope that you guys can get it working the same way as well. So hopefully it will work. So basically, another thing says to turn in run in, in, as administrator and disable full screen or dis disable desktop composition and stuff like that. Those aren't really necessary and neither is disabling the Steam overlay. That was another thing that I had to go up against in forums was that you just dis disable the Steam overlay. And uh, that actually did not have an effect. I had to actually go turn Windows 7 compatibility on like I'm showing you right now. So basically, this is the main step that should be getting the game to work, and I will prove that it works right here. You want to go ahead and hit apply. Okay, close this out. You don't need it anymore. Close this. And now you're going to want to go ahead and hit play. This should also work if you haven't installed the game before. It should go ahead and do the final install like DirectX and Visual Studio or whatever else it has to do. But as you can see, the game is running right now. So it's very exciting. You want to go ahead and uh, make sure you have all your graphic settings turned up and, and everything you want to do. But at this point, you're pretty much good to go. So thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope that this helps somebody out because, I mean, I spent a long time trying to get this game to work. It took me like almost like half a week so far to figure out how to run this game. So kind of wanted to just throw this out, share the information with everybody. Hope that it helps you. Hope that you have some fun game times with Assassin's Creed Liberation. And I will see you. Yeah, I will see you.
in the next video. Oh, and by the way, guys, this should also work if you're running this from Uplay as well. At least I believe it should. Because you're adjusting the compatibility mode in Windows itself. All right, guys, stick around for another video. I'll see you later. Don't forget to follow me at all these great locations, and I will see you around. Jill.